For this video, I'm going to show you something called Go Animate for schools. And although this is something that people use in businesses as well, Go Animate for Schools allows you to keep everything contained in a safe environment so that you and your students will create things and it will stay um, within your specific digital classroom. Um, within Go Animate, the whole point is to create videos about certain topics to present information. And there are many different templates that you can choose from, but I've selected this particular template just to sort of walk, sort of walk you through what you can do with it. So this is Comedy World, and this is uh, Slices of Daily Life. This is the one template that I've selected. And for this, the focus is on just sort of observing things in daily life for you to reenact, make up comical, satirical, or dramatic stories. So the drill for this is very simple. You select a template, you choose your characters, you pull a script out of your observations, and then you just watch it and you view it and you could share it on your website. So you could either scroll down for your next step or hit the next button. And this is where you start creating your scene. So you choose a setting and I've selected the done your homework setting. If you want to take a look at the other ones that are available, you just hit your arrow buttons and that should take you to the different templates available. I'm going to stick with done your homework. Once I've selected that, I hit the next button and then I select characters. So this is the man I'm going to choose as my teacher. But again, if you just hit these buttons, there are other characters you could choose from. And here I need to select a student. This is the boy I'm going to choose. And then again, if I wanted to change that, I would just hit my arrows. Okay, so now I have my characters. I'm going to hit the next button. And we're going to be taken to where I would create my dialogue. You could do up to 20 different lines of dialogue with a, a I'm not, uh, let's see, a 180 character um, limit. You can select a variety of different voices, and if you want to preview a voice, you would just hit the play button to hear what it says. Once you select, select your, vo your voice, you hit confirm, and every time this actor comes up, that's the voice that will be used. Um, if at any time you want to switch up who is speaking, you would just hit this button to switch up your actor. So you type the text in, and that's what the actor would say, or you could actually record your own voice. So once I type in all of my dialogue, when I hit preview, it will start to generate the video. And then this will pop up so you can take a look at how it is, see if you like it. If you like it, then you would save it and share it. Okay, now that we've spent an hour discussing this extremely important topic, can someone tell me something they learned? Anything. Anything at all. And that's it. If you're happy with it, you hit your Save Now button, and you would give it a title, a description, hit save and it would take you to a page with a link where you could either hyperlink it or it'll give you an embed code to embed into your website. I hope you enjoyed.